makes to share with you and the first one is this top that I'm wearing which is Butterick 6175 and I made this out of denim. I had some denim scraps left over from a skirt that I made and I just used it to make this top. Now the pattern does not call for this type of denim fabric but I just wanted to give it a shot because I had some left over and it you know was like the perfect amount so I was like I'm gonna make this top out of this even if it's not what it calls for and I'm pleased with it it's different the top was a little bit short so I did add, add some elastic around the waist just to cinch it in a little bit I took a pair of jeans and cut off the pocket and sewed that down to the front because it looked super plain and I wanted to kind of jazz it up a little bit there is an opening in the back and I just have a little button up there at the top and let me see I think that's it there's really nothing else to say about this little top and yeah <laughs> so my next sewing make I am really happy about because this is my first time sewing a Berta pattern from an envelope in the store and I am really happy with the way these came out so this pattern is Berta 6471 and what it is is a pair of cropped knit pants and this is my version and it has a mock front opening there is elastic in the back it's got pleats in the front pockets on the side I did use some scraps so that's why the pocket is black right there so I was able to use some black uh, knit scraps that I had left over and um, there's elastic at the leg opening the leg opening did call for a zipper in this pattern an invisible zipper i didn't want a zipper on the side so i just put the elastic in and then just closed up the uh, opening so yes i am really happy about my little burda pants because i was afraid because of all the things that i heard about burda patterns and the directions not being very clear so i took my time and with the pictures i was able to kind of figure things out and it was not that bad so um, yeah, I plan in the future to buy some more burda patterns and like I said, I don't know if I said this or not, but I stuck with something that was easy and um, I'll just continue to do that until maybe I feel a little more comfortable to maybe step it up a little bit. But I am really excited that I tried something new. So yeah, I'll go ahead and show you what these look like on. to be a product that I purchased on Amazon and this is a magnetic wristband and this is definitely not meant to be a sewing notion but when I saw it I thought that it would be perfect to put on my wrist or for you guys if you're interested you can wear it on your wrist and put your pins on it so I have some pins here and yeah I like this so I have been using this when I sew and it's easy to use you just you know you just kind of let your pen go and it just snaps onto the wristband so i really like that so if you're interested i will put a link to this product down below um so you can get one of your own so yeah that is all that i have for you today my little top it's really stiff and um yeah it's got you know some little wrinkles going on there because the, the fabric is not flowy like it should be but that is it, so um, thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.